In this video, I'm going to show you how you can easily pay with Apple Pay on your iPhone. Be sure to watch the video to the very end so you don't make any mistakes and of course do not forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks guys! So let's get started and first off head over to settings and then scroll down until you find Face ID and Passcode. Then it may ask you to enter your current passcode and here we need to make sure that Face ID is enabled. If uh, there is an option that says enable or set up Face ID, it means that you have turned it off and you need to click on it to turn it on. The same goes for passcode. If it says turn on passcode, just tap on it to set passcode for that device. After that you can go back to settings and then tap add wallet and Apple Pay. Right here you need to add your payment cards to your Apple Pay. To do that just tap where it says add card. Then select a debit or credit card or transit card. And then if you hit add continue you will be able to scan your card or you can just tap at uh, edit card details manually and then just uh, enter your card details to add your card to uh, wallet and Apple Pay. After that your card will appear right here at payment cards and you will be able to use that card to pay in the stores and in the app store. If you want to activate Apple Pay with the side button, all you have to do is just turn on the option which is called double click side button. And if it is turned on, you will be able to double press the side button to activate Apple Pay. And then you can use your Face ID, just like that, to uh, pay using your payment card. The same goes for the App Store. Once you find an app that you want to purchase, all you have to do is just uh, tap at that button and it will come up with uh, that pop-up. And if you hit Add Purchase, it will scan your face to buy that particular app. Now you can write down in the comments below if you have any questions about that tutorial. Hit the like button if you like that video and see you in the next one.